Hello everyone, in this lesson I want to talk about the steps to rename a printer on Windows 11. If you have to change the name of your printer for any reason, the operating system offers different ways to complete this configuration. And in this video, we're going to look at 5 ways to do this. Ok, let's dive into the steps, but before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. This will help the channel and you will be supporting my work. The first method that I want to show you is for devices running Windows 11 version 24H2 as Microsoft has updated the printer settings in the operating system. If you have an older version, check the timestamps on the description to jump to the next method that will help everyone running Windows 11 version 23H2 or an older version. So to rename a printer on Windows 11, open Start, look for Settings, then open Bluetooth and Devices, and then on Printers and Scanners, open the printer. And this might not be an issue, but sometimes if you don't have the, the printer turned on, you might not be able to access the settings. So make sure the printer is turned on before proceeding. Then click on Additional Printer Settings. And in here, you can see that we have a Rename Your Printer option. And then you just need to click the Rename button. And you need to specify the new name for the printer. Then click Save. And that is all there is to it. Now, to change the name of the printer on Windows 11 version 23H2 and all the versions, you need to do this. Open Start and look for the Settings app. Then go to Bluetooth and Devices. Then open Printers and Scanners. Select the printer, and in here we're going to click the Printer Properties option. This will open the Legacy settings for the printer, and on the General tab, make sure to specify the name of the printer, and then click the OK button. And that is all there is to it. Now, if you're running Windows 11 Pro, you can also use the Print Management Console to change the printer name. And to do that, open Start and look for the Print Management tool, open All Printers, choose the Rename option. Specify the new name and press enter. And that should update the name throughout the operating system. Just remember that you cannot use these steps on Windows 11 Home. It is also possible to change the name of the printer using command prompt. And to do that, open start and look for command prompt or the terminal. Right click on the application and select the run as administrator option. Now, the first thing that we have to do is to know the actual name of the current printer. And to do that, we're going to be using this command. Then press enter. This is going to give us the name of the printers available on the computer. And then we need to use this command that actually uses a script to change different configurations of a printer. But you can also use it to rename the device. You just need to specify this command. The only thing you have to change is the current name for the printer. And then you need to specify the new name for the printer. If the name contains a space, it's recommended to use the quotation marks. And then press Enter. And as you can see, now the printer has been renamed. We can actually repeat the first command to further confirm that the printer name has been updated. You can also complete this task from PowerShell. And to do that, open Start and look for PowerShell or the Windows Terminal. In this case, I'm just going to use the terminal, right click on the applications and select the run as administrator option. Then I'm going to switch to PowerShell. I'm going to clear the screen and then I'm going to use this command to show the install printers on the computer. But we're only going to show the name and the driver name. And as you can see, my printer is right here. And then we need to run this command. And, and the only thing that you have to change is the actual name and the new name that you want to use for the device. And then just press enter. And now the printer has been renamed. We can run the get printer command again. And we can see that the printer has a new name now. And that is all there is to it. Those were five ways that you can use to change the name of the printer to anything you want. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you. And I would like to thank you for viewing.